Kosuke will keep catching. We are here on uh, Narragansett Bay, We're working with the Commercial Fisheries Research Foundation, doing a little um, ghost gear investigation. Uh, ghost gear is essentially uh, derelict fishing pots and nets and uh, material that's been left behind. And they think that it makes up 10% of all ocean plastic marine debris. It's crazy because I grew up here sailing my whole life and um, it's all been kind of happening under my nose and it's just something that I wasn't uh, really aware of until just recently. So it's been nice to peel back the onion and take a look at uh, what's going on here locally. Let's see if we can't catch something. It's an underwater housing for a GoPro and then we zip tied underwater light to it. John, the captain of the Christopher Andrew has incentive to remove ghost gear because it's coming up in his trawl paths. So he's trawling in his areas and he's having to bring up ghost gear in his nets. They have to work to cut that out. It's not really easy for them to bring it in. So what they do is they, they drop it off somewhere else, a pile, so we can remove that burden. Um, there's grounds that they won't tow it anymore because the gear is piled up there. And then the third reason is that it's impacting the animals potentially that they fish on. Trying to use fishermen's knowledge to map where ghost gear is in the bay. And what they do for us is on a nautical chart, they circle an area and say, This is where we dump gear, this is where I've caught gear before. So, what we're trying to do with this project is to get all that knowledge on a map and have a removal map basically, and then also try and see if we can focus those areas with camera work. As a commercial fisherman, I think it's a great idea to get this stuff out of the bay and I, I'm sure most fishermen feel the same way. We could go fishing and be done with work by now already today and make the same or more, but we're doing it primarily to get the gear out of the bay. That, that, that's the goal. And I think it will work in the long run if, if, you know, if we stick with it. Just got to fine tune some stuff with the camera system and the grapple system. But this is the first trip out. And I think it went all right for the first trip. We've seen the bugs that need to be worked out. And uh, it's, a, it's a very good idea for the Bay overall. <laughs>